Gaming Bolt presents 15 Xbox One console exclusives to look forward to in 2018 and beyond. The new year is finally here, and while the Xbox One's game selection has looked a bit bleak in 2017, 2018 and beyond promises a number of great things. Whether it's the next wave of titles in Microsoft's stable of IPs or a cavalcade of intriguing indies, here are 15 Xbox One console exclusives to look forward to in the coming years. Next, Halo. The big question ever since the release of Halo 5 has been obvious. When is the next Halo coming? And no, Halo Wars 2 doesn't count. As per 343 Industries founder and head, Bonnie Ross in June of 2017, the development team is currently working on the next big Halo. Apparently it was good, but not quite ready for announcement. Could E3 2018 be the right time? One can certainly hope. Next, Gears of War. What's going on with the next Gears of War? Well, just like Halo, we only have Xbox Phil Spencer's words to go by when he says it's shaping up to be beautiful. Given the cliffhanger ending in Gears of War 4, there are several directions the franchise could go in, but we'll probably have to wait until 2019 for any kind of a reveal. State of Decay 2 If you haven't played State of Decay, it can be best described as a mix of survival, base building, resource management, relationship building, combat, exploration, and so on and so forth. State of Decay 2 will be even bigger, introducing multiple cities, four-player co-op, and more zombies. Don't worry about its looks, once you're in the world, there's no escape. The Last Night Controversies aside, Odd Tales The Last Night made an impression at E3 2017 for its gorgeous combination of pixel art, compositing, and 3D work. As pretty as this dystopian take on humanity looks, we're interested in whether the stealth and gunfights are actually fun. In terms of cyberpunk experiences on the Xbox One, The Last Night stands out in its own quirky way. Below. Capybara Games Below has been in development since seemingly forever. It's microscopic overhead gameplay eluding us time and time again. The premise of roguelike mechanics, randomly generated environments, and permadeath still intrigues us though. Last we checked, the developer is still focused on the game and will announce a release date when it's ready. So take that for what you will. Sea of Thieves Releasing on March 20th, 2018, Sea of Thieves is Rare's first new IP since, well, it's been a long, long time. This isn't your typical platformer like Conquer or Banjo-Kazooie. Sea of Thieves is an open, shared world adventure where players form pirate crews and embark on adventures. There are companies to fulfill tasks for, skeletons to fight, and treasure to find. Will it amount to a fun experience? Well, we'll find out in March. Crackdown 3 Ever since its delay into 2018, Crackdown 3 hasn't really had much new information revealed. This project, developed by Sumo Digital, Regent Games, Ruffian Games, and Clowngen, combines open-world crime fighting with supercop powers and destruction. It also has Joseph Staten of Halo fame as the writer. It's intriguing enough, and hopefully there's an actual release date this year. Ori and the Will of the Wisps Moon Studios' breakout Metroidvania platformer Ori and the Blind Forest combined gorgeous visuals with excellent platforming and a number of challenges. Ori and the Will of the Wisps seemingly continues down the tragic Ferngully-esque narrative route as Ori faces new challenges. Again, there's no release date, but 2018 seems like a safe bet. Black Desert Online Pearl Abyss's gorgeous MMORPG Black Desert Online is finally coming to consoles, but it will arrive on Xbox One in Q1 of 2018. The game sports a huge open world to explore with tons of quests, not to mention some of the coolest looking real-time combat out there. While we're unsure how the game's grind has shaped up over the years, Black Desert Online is still an interesting exclusive for Microsoft's console. Player Unknown's Battlegrounds 1.0 you may or may not be enjoying PlayerUnknown's Battlegrounds on the Xbox One. Launch issues have more or less been resolved, but make no mistake, this is still an early access version of the game on console. For the actual 1.0 release that's currently available on PC, we'll need to wait a bit longer. If the speed of updates and fixes is any indication, it shouldn't be long before PlayerUnknown's Battlegrounds 1.0 is on Xbox One. Ashen not to be confused with the Engage game of the same name, Ashen is a fantasy RPG and the product of Aurora 44. 
The overall combat embodies Dark Souls, but there are survival elements and an aesthetic that calls Cormac McCarthy's The Road to Mind. Multiplayer elements, open world exploration, ranged combat, and much more make Ashen a rather intriguing game to watch out for. Fable 4 Rumored The shuttering of Lionhead Studios not so long ago wasn't sad just simply because the studio would no longer be operational or because their upcoming title Fable Legends had been cancelled, but also because it threw the future of the entire Fable franchise into jeopardy. Fable has to be one of the most beloved Xbox franchises in spite of all of its ups and downs, which is why we're incredibly excited about this report we're bringing to you today. Don Williamson, who used to be the lead engine programmer at Lionhead Studios at one time, recently took to Twitter and claimed that, in spite of having no insider info, he was pretty certain of who Microsoft had entrusted with working on Fable 4. Having no inside information, I totally know who's building Fable 4 now, Williamson wrote in a tweet that has since been deleted, before adding, interesting choice. We will see whether this materializes in the coming days. Fable Fortune Currently in Xbox Game Preview, Fable Fortune is a card battler in the vein of Hearthstone and Gwent. The twist is that Fable Fortune focuses on co-op play against bosses and choosing your own path towards good or evil. It's a compelling mix of cards and classes, though some may find the co-op wanting. Fable Fortune still doesn't have a full release date, but its current state is very much playable and fun. Astroneer Described as no Man's Sky, but actually fun, and no, I haven't played the latest updates, why do you ask? Astroneer is a space sandbox title that's currently in Steam, Early Access, and Xbox Games Preview. It's had a number of updates, and the game's model of exploration and colonization has drawn its fair share of players. Let's see how the full commercial release shapes up. The Darwin Project Try and forget about the shoutcasting debacle that was the game's announcement at E3 2017. The Darwin Project is a mix of survival mechanics and abilities with a Hunger Games motif. Also, much like Left 4 Dead, there's a director behind the scenes who can influence the action and tip the scales. The Darwin Project is coming to Xbox One first, though again, an actual release date is yet to be announced. And that'll be about it for this one. If you guys like what we're doing at Gaming Bolt, please consider subscribing to our channel, and I'll see you guys on the next video.